Hi guys, I want to talk a minute about some art supplies for our watercolor paintings. Literally any kind of little reusable plastic container is fine. I want to show you what to use to stretch your watercolor paper onto. This is really inexpensive thick, hard insulation board. You can get it at Home Depot. And what I have done is I've taken it, I left the plastic part on, and I duct taped around it because I don't want water to seep out and over and make my surface not level anymore. So you want a surface that is as level as possible. Here is the cold pressed Hanson paper. We are going to need some masking tape to mask out some parts. A piece of fine grit sandpaper for your watercolor pencils and you really don't need a whole set. Watercolor paint. This is dollar and roundy. I also have some older paints. I have some gauche. And then a Chinese takeout container for putting just dabs of your paint on. Just a few brushes. Nothing big. This is a sea sponge. I think it's important to have a ruler and some gloves for when you stretch your paper. 100% cotton t-shirt or paper towels. You can also take the back of the painting, the board, paint it with the Rust-Oleum waterproofing and then lightly sand it. Just something that prevents you from getting water under where you're stretching your paper. So we're gonna get ready here and stretch some paper in a little bit. This was a painting I'm working on, but I will probably duct tape around this other board and we will take some in the sink or we will stretch our paper with um, maybe a baking sheet or something that you can soak the paper in and then stretch it out. And staples, I used a few staples only because I really like for things to be nice and taut. And then we're gonna get ready to paint. I look forward to art your heart out.